conclusion. Humans who receive instructions about consciousness as stimulation within psychology and psychiatry and behavior observe aren't motivated unless they receive what they need from a source provided by a government and humans who are dominant, intelligent and brilliant geniuses. They are not mathematically solving climate change with energy for a body. They are receiving goods from a government. They no longer need to receive from a business to survive now. In other words, economics are extraneous and unnecessary. Government simply needs to print money, hand out food, and allow everyone to do their arts and entertainment and their skateboarding now. Graffitiing, dancing and doing, gymnastics in a civilization world now. They say has to do with consciousness. However, unfortunately, humans who live outside of civilization and choose to avoid a city and gangs and thugs and drug addicts, bullies and violence, have to have attention entering a forest to hunt and awareness locating an elk. Concentration and focus to peacefully end a life on earth now. And strength and power to rip the meat off the bones and carry them home on their backs for their families and animals who support their needs as humans now. Using small amounts of stimulation to increase Cognition, visualization, decision making, and choosing options efficiently for when cold winter arrives and there's no food available. No heat except wood gathered from trees. Now. Art and culture Stimulation for humans. Including ethnicity and diversity and dialect, race. Making hormones stronger and more intense.
birth rates. And friendships now. Important for brain. In world in a city. And secondary. Where there's no grocery store. No electricity providing energy business now. And part of their economics, selling furs, boats and canoes, sweaters and hats from resources they use. instead of throwing away in a trash container now. A place where drugs would kill a human faster than walking outside in a winter storm with no coat, hunting and falling asleep with no fire. Having neurons in synapses minimized and reduced, failing to kill a food source animal and going hungry instead of well-fed, full of life, warmth, compassion, and happiness now. person has to decide outside of civilization and world, in wilderness and country, do they make meth with their used soda bottles? Do they make friends with a cartel to buy their crack cocaine? And do they have their fentanyl shipped? from China to their address with the USPS. Or do they enjoy their freedom tenacity and grit lucid color vivid mountains and snow-covered tree, sitting in caves with a fire instead of a phone in a dark room hiding from a manager boss now. Sleeping with a yak instead of using ego and mind and self in world to have a companion who participates in their system of psychology and behavior and mind and control and restriction and limit and observation. Now,
China agrees with y'all. Consciousness has to do with some fentanyl, a lot of work. And lots of dominance. Lots of pictures of a president elected by a communist council. And in Venezuela, a man the size of Arnold Schwarzenegger with an army, with a military, armed with rifles and knives to stop anyone who disagrees. with their processes and their system deciding consciousness has to do with a social stimulation and reward provided by agreeance, personality, and most of all, obedience. Achieving goals and reaching success as a group instead of humans struggling with frustration and confusion and misdirection and uncertainty. Now, choosing art and culture and diversity and ethnicity and race, tribal and indigenous and primitive and behavior and dominance and observation and gosh darn psychology. However, with different descriptions, terms, and allowed usages to not disrupt a calm and relaxed civilization and world controlled within those processes involving mind and self and ego strength and power beauty and sexiness elegance and lots of stimulation to reward those who don't resist their world on a planet floating in outer space now.